So I think we got this kind of figured out what's going on. I'm not sure. Uh, anyways, today is the 3rd of December, 2023. Uh, it's been a while since I, I posted a, a video to give any updates of what's going on and let everybody know, you know, everything normal. Normal. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, we're, we're down here at the power plant. We're running the smaller unit. Uh, it was down. We re did a repair on it, major repair. And uh, that was uh, uh, middle of beginning of last month we did that. Uh, we got it back together. It's been running great since. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, but we've ran all, all year. We haven't had any major shutdowns at all. Which is surprisingly, you know, to me, that it's just running great. We see uh, uh, a lot of uh, uh, a, a lot of times we've seen where we we've, we've shut down July, August, and September just because of low flow. But we haven't had low flow this year. It's been a really unusual year for the power plant. Uh, been a pro very profitable year for the power plant. Uh, but uh, you know, throw a throw a major shut a breakdown in that. And, you know, there's nothing that I did that I didn't bring. It's just mechanical failure. Uh, uh, these these units sit out here and spin continually, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And it, this one this one ran for about uh, 10 years. So <coughs> something's bound to give and break at some point. It did, and so we. Uh, we have to deal with that. Anyways, let's go take a quick look around. Um, I don't know how well this is working, but you can see how gray it is out here. And uh, it is rather miserable. This is, it's, it, it's not pretty at all. <laughs> I've had to use the tractor a couple times this, uh, this year. This is this snow melt is, uh, that, that we're getting now is is early snow. Uh, we started seeing early November seeing snow, and uh, it froze it froze solid like a big icicle. Uh, so we got that taken care of. We got it back up and running, and then we uh, managed to. Uh, uh, Get another snow right up on top of it after we got everything done. The tractor has been absolutely phenomenal this year. The the new tires, uh, the good chains, uh, it has it has worked fabulously so far this year. Uh, it's got seems like it has I don't I wouldn't say more power, but we've been able to put more power to the ground so. Uh, makes a big difference. Of course, the chickens and the ducks are in their in their in their winter quarters. Uh, they have. Uh, let's see how bad the pool looks. They they are, actually is a pool in here. The, everybody's hanging out in the. Hard to see them in there, but they're in there. We've got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It gets. When things start to melt, it obviously, you know, the ground gets a little wetter. But uh, for the most part, everything's doing great. We have. Uh, this is this is nine by sixteen here, plus this addition back here. Uh, so where everybody can can uh, you know get along there's a, uh, a a little pond back there a little little kiddie pool uh, and every day we clean, put clean water in it and the ducks get in it so well hello there how are you what are you doing she wants to be the star but uh, for the most part they they get in here and they they uh, you know they stay in here uh, they don't go out gonna push the little water out here a 
we do have we do have a door down here we can open it up <coughs> but they won't go outside simply because of the snow they they don't like walking in the snow nobody likes the snow and you know you can see where it rolls off the front of the uh, the building and they just do not they don't like coming in and out of that so they don't stay they stay away from that let's get over here and take a look at the the river you see uh we run a little the, the river's a little lower than it than than what we like to see it but again uh with the rain coming today it's probably going to fill back up you know it's a it's it's one of those things that <laughs> I've noticed. When you live in a spot, you don't really get to see the spot. Uh, if you understand what I'm saying, is uh, is where you're at, you don't you don't recognize the beauty that you that's around you, because you get see you see it every day. Uh, you know, some people say, "Wow, that's just fantastic to be able to look at a view like this when you're at work every day," and and, and you know it really is because. I've had jobs where I've worked in factories, and you stare at a wall, uh, and, and I hated it, absolutely hated it. Uh, but that's that's me. There are people that just love that kind of work, can do that kind of work all day long. It doesn't bother them. Uh, but you know, I'm one that always wanted to build a a life where <laughs> I didn't have to uh, have a vacation from. Uh, and so, I guess I'm a little bit different than everybody else, but I, I thoroughly enjoy the stuff that I do. Uh, I have absolutely no regrets. And, uh, you know, people think I'm, I'm crazy, but you, 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 in my, my opinion is you want to build, build a life that will be self-sustaining that uh, you can uh, you you don't have to work be a slave for the dollar to make the next payment uh, obviously there's jobs out there where you you need to have <laughs> you need to have uh, the most updated equipment and and you know and you have to make payments but generally uh, you you know those kind of that that's part of business but I, I teach my grandkids every opportunity that I can that, uh, that you know there's more to life than just going to work and earning a dollar and uh, it's tough for them to understand that sometimes but that's just the truth there's <laughs> the money money is important uh, get me don't get me wrong at all Money is very important because it's a tool that you can use to acquire the things that you need to acquire. But it's not all about how much money you can accumulate. Uh, it's, a, it's 